Alrighty ho, peepers and creepers. So as I said, like my last video, I've been slacking on my travel recording here. But we are, um... New text I, message from Candace. I'm in the area of, uh, the Upper Salt River, you know, where we tend to do some catfishing. And I'm leaving Eucalyptus heading somewhat in a southerly direction so I, I don't know if you're not from here you're probably not going to understand quite where I'm at um, I didn't record coming in which I should have but no biggie so we're going to just take a little ride here in the area of uh, eucalyptus and we are going to head to what I call what we call Eads Wash and there have been some crazy dudes, man, bring their trailers back in here. I don't know how the hell they do it, but they do it. But, uh, anyways, uh, we're going to go in here just to that first part and, and see what see what I see. You know, I'd like to throw the pole in, do a little catfishing. But, uh, let's see what's going on here. I'm surprised this ain't all flooded out. This roads ain't too bad. You probably get you a little car in here if you're comfortable or careful. But uh, anyways, man, it's really dry right here. That's kind of crazy with all the rain they've been getting. Hmm. You could drive down that stuff right there. That's pretty cool. But man, it gets you in a gnarly area. You'll get Arizona pinstripe all day long down that road. So if you want some of that shit, go for it. Take the old Ram 2500 2018 route. So I don't scratch up, no, don't want to scratch up the baby here. Uh, this is a weekend, so I, I predict there's probably going to be a bunch of catfishers over here messing around with these cats. But really, the water's flowing so hard, I'd, I'd be surprised if anybody's catching anything. Trying to keep your stank bait on, or your shrimp, or your whatever. Some people say they use hot dogs, crazy motherfuckers. Uh, but trying to keep that bait on your hook, I don't think it's going to happen. You know? Sure, you probably need about a 10 pound sinker just to hold your weight down. But, anyways, just out here doing a little camping, trying to get my fishing on. You know, got my cooking going right now back at camp. I got me a crock pot going with some corned beef, carrots, potatoes. And a day late, I missed the, I came out here late last night. And, you know, so I just wasn't uh, able to get my corned beef going. So I'm going to do a, a, a late, what do they call that shit? A redo or a, a 2.1. Uh, Irish day, whatever the hell they call that shit. But, uh, anyways, uh, that should be ready about 4 p.m. Oh, no, I gotta throw my cabbage in there for about an hour after that, so. But, uh, anyways, damn, this road's pretty goddamn good from what I remember. Ooh. I thought I was gonna scrape up the old rammer even on this road, but it's pretty good. Pretty good cruise. And every once in a while, there's a little turn off in here and we'll get you a little secret spot. But with that secret spot comes Arizona pinstripe like a son bitch. Anyways, uh, I think I'll bore you with this desert ride here until I get to Eads Wash. Oh, uh, shouldn't be too. Oh, shouldn't be too much further. See, the homeboy got his little lowered. Uh, Little roller, roller GMC out here cruising by smoking that devil's cabbage. Devil's cabbage and drinking a little bit of, of God's good old yeast. Shoot. He ain't fooling nobody. <laughs> here it is. Eads Wash. Ooh, I don't know if you saw the sign. But it says Eads Wash. New text message from Candace. Let me see. So you can New take... text message from Bree. You can go down that road is a good spot right down in there. But over here it opens up really good. You can just drive right on up. 
Ooh, we got a camper up in there. Oh, shoot. Look at this water. Ah, damn, man. There ain't no Eads Wash left. Man, looks like Eads Wash is washed away. Holy shit, Batman. Man, ain't gonna be no catfishing for the big old right now. I need some bigger sinkers. Damn. This is looking good. The summer's gonna be some good time down here. Good swimming. Good looking. Maybe some cooking down here, too. Shoot. Man. This guy got it set up. Yeah. Go by and see what he's grilling up. See if he got an extra fucking hot dog I can slam in my mouth. <laughs> Giggity. Oh, yeah. This is cool, man. Oh, shit. I might. You know what? I might throw my shit in right now. Oh, hells yeah, man. Right there. Straight out front. You know, maybe the cats are trying to get away from that rough current. Shoot, man. It looks, I like that little corner over there. Let me go over there, man. Yeah, shit, I'm going to do me a little fishing right now. Oh, the ram trying to get stuck. She trying to get stuck. She's trying to get stuck. Look at that. Little, little fucking two inch sand. Goddamn 2500 trying to get stuck already. Fuck. I'm gonna go get my Chevy. My old Ford eat this shit up like goddamn caviar and shit. Fucking ram over here gonna fucking get stuck. You have to get winched out. All that bullshit. Alright. Let's see what the ram gonna do right here. Let's see, we got a little bit of over on there. There she go already. Trying to get stuck. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I'll respect that mud right there, though. Oh, yeah, that looks like a damn good spot right there, man. Fuck, okay, I'm going to pull me out a cat right now. 